everybody, this is not a spring chicken. And I know they thought it was really kind of funny because I was just sitting here thinking and waiting, and they're like, hmm. I think I was a model at one point in my life. <laughs> anyway, I guess news still continues. Actually, the big news in LA is Space Shuttle Endeavor. Oh, is getting ready to go through the streets of Los Angeles tonight. Oh, wait a minute. Would that be overshadowed by that debate between, oh, yeah, Biden and Ryan? Ooh. I don't know, but it looks like somebody's going to the slaughterhouse. No, yes, and unemployment figures had nothing to do with affecting what might happen in the debate. Meanwhile, we're going to bring old Cam on with comments on the headlines of today. Uh, and it's a little bit dark today because the Kickstarter campaign, well, is it's still in the dawn stages. Yeah, well, let's put it this way. When you're trying to do something that's politically incorrect in an area that basically thrives on political correctness, it's never has a chance, but there's always a hope that people will change, but they don't. And it's all over for the Republicans. Well, yeah, well, the, the reviews were all in. Biden basically saved the day. Oops! They basically shot poor Biden in the foot today. The, uh, the market was at 138 points up in an Obama rally today, and on, and on the fact that the the unemployment, people filing first for unemployment was basically down by the lowest figure it has been in four years. And then somebody started taking the key. What people really don't understand is in Chicago politics, they don't think beyond Chicago. So they start, somebody started counting the unemployment things in all the states, and all of a sudden, the states that support Obama the most didn't report the unemployment, what would the... Uh, the unemployment figures were in their states. Oh. Yeah, and then, uh, so now there's an asterisk against the thing, so instead of people talking about Biden winning this thing, they're talking about basically Biden has a, almost an impossible task tonight because for, he's going to get hit by uh, Ryan. First of all, they said they're also, Democrats, well, there's going to be a criminal investigation now uh, into what's being done because it looks like uh, agency is supposed to be totally independent is now in the back pocket of the president because nobody I know. bought last week's figures being as low as they are now really they did not buy this figure that basically the lowest figure amount of people in, in the, and basically this includes the, the uh, Bush administration before mm -hmm. unemployment started hitting it's before the unemployment problem so and Biden has to, you know, they're going to hammer him. Ryan's going to hammer him on that tonight. And, okay, that they may have prepared Biden for everything. They did not prepare him for the ungodly disaster that's hit today. I know, and I actually almost feel sorry for Biden because, well, between the unemployment figures and Obama came in, coming out and saying in the last debate he had a bad day. And he was or tired. had a bad night. I was tired. <laughs> I was too polite. I was tired, you know. And everybody laughing at him because they realized he really can't. Okay, they, they had a thing here Sunday in Los Angeles, a fundraiser, where they were not laughing with the president on his big jokes. They were laughing at him because as the guys there whispering, he has to use a teleprompter to tell his jokes. Mm -hmm. And they're laughing at him now. And they said, um, you know, that, uh, here's the problem too. The same people last week that were criticizing people that dared suggest there was any collusion with the presidency, and the uh, figures from the, from the Labor Department are now today, we're going to, uh, you, we're basically, we no longer can depend upon the Labor Department to give us accurate figures, so you're going to have to look, we're going to have to take it off the board now for buying stock. He took it, Obama <gasps> took it oh off the board gosh. a month before, it, it's basically what happens in Chicago, this is how they handle everything in Chicago, boom, 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 it's with a sledgehammer. Mm -hmm. They do not how to do, there, there is no finesse with the Chicago machine. It is basically hit you over the head with a two before, and if a two before doesn't work, they hit you in the head with a four by four. And they simply want everything, they put, they took, they, they got by with the last week, well, we got by with the last week, we could do it better this week. And man with bulletproof vest and body bags arrested at LA airport. First of all, there's nothing illegal about having a bulletproof bag, a bulletproof vest and body bag, so they that there's nothing totally illegal about doing that. They think, well, he might have been planning. Did he have a weapon with him? No. Did he have any device to kill people with him? No. He had a bulletproof bag, and he had a bulletproof vest and body bags. It, there's, 
You know, first of all, if a he guy's, could be a supplier. He could be a supplier, folks. He's wearing it because, okay, this is the way it works. If a police officer um, basically he's is, is, is on duty on the airplane because he has, when he gets off he has to go bring somebody back, he's got his vest on. Mm -hmm. And uh, the body bags can be simple as something you tossed in your luggage and didn't even think about. It could be like a duffel bag. But it isn't, it isn't illegal. So what they did was the TSA picked up a person for breaking no laws, and now they're going to get sued again. Yeah, they're going to get sued for that one. Yeah. And Al-Qaeda is making a comeback, an Iraq official said. Yeah, uh, they said they're basically yesterday all over the thing. Everybody basically, oh, here's what it is. In the world of politics, you throw everybody else under your wheels in order to save your butt. And basically, the... Uh, State Department's throwing Obama under the wheels of the bus. The military is throwing him under. The security people, Central Agency, all of them are throwing the thing that, you know, because Obama came out at the Democratic Convention. You know, Ben Laden is dead and Al Qaeda is, is on the run. Well, it turns out when he made that statement, he knew that Al Qaeda was rebuilding. And they said, Has anybody actually seen the body of a dead? Mm -hmm. uh, no, no one has. So now they're beginning, there are those doubts. Well, we have to do this because. We didn't want to offend the Muslims, so basically you toss the guy's body in the ocean, which automatically offends the Muslims, which since they weren't offended means he didn't toss the body in the ocean. And SpaceX rocket glitch put satellite in the wrong orbit. I know. They were just talking about these are the people that are supposed to be the supply people, and they screwed up on a satellite launch. Mm. So. And California gas prices stabilize and seen heading downward. Is anybody... We, we, we got... Yeah, two cents heading two, downward. Yeah, two cents. <laughs> it, yesterday it went down to a. Okay, they don't even count a half cent. It fell a half cent yesterday, a half cent, and they don't. It's not statistically able to be rounded off to the next thing. So it didn't go to the gas pumps today in Southern California, folks. You're going to see the prices today are the same prices they were Monday, and this is Thursday. And affirmative action and rights cases await the U.S. Supreme Court. Oh, they're going to, they're going to rule. The Supreme Court never undoes, undoes a former court thing. What they're going to say is simply narrow it to down to the one case that the, that the, uh, the, the college used the wrong method on entrance for this student. And then they basically, everybody's happy. It solves nothing. Uh, because, okay, here's what one uh, Justice Scalia said. Uh, the average time between reviewing cases is 25 years. And he said, uh, and he said, it must have been nine years. I think it's a little too early for us to review a case. Mm -hmm. And Arizona to appeal the judge's ruling against the part of immigration law. Well, yeah, because what happens is uh, they got the, the go-ahead from the Supreme Court, and then the Democrats, uh, uh, here's how it's working. The Democrats, the, the, just, the judge said that while the law is legal, it's not fair to put it into effect until at first of the year. The same thing is that all these justices now are saying that while the uh, states had the right to pass the, to pass the uh, Voters Law Act, Voter you know, ID Acts, it's not fair to do it now. So they can do it after the election for the next election. Basically, it, it sucks, folks. There, just anything they can do to get this president elected, the whole system is seeing what Chicago's like. And state adopts a wider law on guns. Yeah, basically it's got to restrict, okay, Hunters, uh, pe hunters in California are not allowed to carry their rifles in, clean, in clear sight. Now they have to be hid away, which I can guarantee you, my father said, the one thing that a motorcycle officer does not want to do is to go up to a vehicle uh, with a suspicion that they might, okay, if there's a gun rack in the back, they got a suspicion they're carrying a gun. Yeah, so, that's a good clue. Yeah, and uh, now by California laws, you can no longer put your guns on the rack. You have to put them under something. Well, so people get good people get sh shot for making moves that the officer thinks is uh, dangerous. And Brown acts on driver's license and deportation bills. Oh yeah, he's made it. Uh, uh, illegal aliens can now get driver's license in California. Oh, they can. Yeah, which mm -hmm. means that they once they get a driver's license, they can vote. Isn't that a good one? Hmm. And no one wants more taxes. Uh, I know, but they, 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 even though no one wants more taxes, they're always willing to put a tax on the other guy. There is no such thing as putting a tax on the other guy. They don't seem to get the message in California, for instance. There is an increase in the sales tax. Increases in sales taxes never go away. Mm. 
So when they, well, it's only a temporary increase in sales tax. No, it's not. The last temporary increase, the, okay, the first temporary increase is still there. And police officer possibly shot in Inglewood. Yeah. Possibly shot? Yeah, basically was shot by another officer. What happens is, on off-duty officers all carry guns, and what happens is somebody reports a guy with a gun, other officers from another precinct show up, and they don't know the guy's an officer, and like, the, my, like I said about my father, if the guy looks like he's going for a gun, they shoot you first, and then, oops. Oh. Yeah. And a Monty bubble is a film Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. Okay, then we change this one again. That when things are going bad, they continue to go bad.